Hey there, friends, and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming. I'm Brianna White, the voice actress of Aerith in Final Fantasy VII Remake. This game right here. So it's very exciting. It's going to be a great playthrough today. We are in a really good part of the story, and I'm just not going to say any more. We're just going to get to it. Take a second before we begin to hit the like button, and we'll get on to the gameplay video. Enjoy. Magical Materia Shop. Perfect. Let me in! Oh my! Hello, sir. See the sign Looks up like front? he's All been I got is waiting for us. Okay, what fun stuff do we have? Healing, cleansing, fire, ice, lightning, poison, barrier, HP up, MP up, deadly dodge. And that's... That's it. Okay. Is there anything fun we can sell so that we have some more... Gil. We're gonna keep our potions. These aren't worth anything anyway. You hasten whoever drinks it, but you know, meh. What else do we have? We've got a lot of lightning in here. So maybe we sell some lightning. These are the ones you really want to sell. We have three MP ups. We do not need three of them. So we're gonna sell one. Then, oh. I love the idea of an extra materia slot, but I cannot do that to Aerith's defense. I just cannot. Plus, she's wearing the rebel wristlet and she will continue wearing that. If it's the last thing I do. Okay, protective boots. Immune to slow, immune to stop. Now this is the kind of item that I would like to have on the eventual circumstance that I might need it for a very specific fight where I get slowed or stopped all the time. But it's worth a lot of gill. And I like gill. Thanks, buddy. We'll hold off on it. You're welcome, buddy. Okay, so we did that. There's obviously something going on below or above. How we get there? No idea. So let's go in here. Hello? It's locked. Okay. So that's locked. So we can go this direction. See what there is to see. I feel rejuvenated and alive. It's like I've got a brand new body. Okay. Feel rejuvenated and alive. Sure. Uh -oh. Oh, we needed to go in the direction of Chadley and then there's that Potion juice. Oh, here's an up. Did we go up yet? It looks like we have gone up here, but oh take! Oh chaos Feels so good to take. Freely! And without being inhibited. No problem. Okay, there's Chadley, my good sir. And what do we have in here? Ah, oh, a clothing boutique. Yep. Until you see the price tag and size, exactly. When I shop in stores like these, okay. Mm, now we'll go this way. Warm, relaxation, the sweet embrace this of free ladies. This guy. Oh, that's what I need. Wait, 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 wait! You really want me to run after you? Ugh, no. I'll go get you later. 
do you got here? Chocobos? Okay. Chocobo bean popcorn. Oh, what have we here? Is that all you got? I tell it is. We just got a bunch of dudes working out, doing dude stuff. Okay. Oh, look at you. Go for it. You get it. Anything fun here? No. Nothing of note. Okay. Can't do anything here. Not even anybody to talk to. So. What about back here? Take! Ooh, grimy bathroom though. Nasty. I don't want to wear a headband I found in a grimy bathroom. Ooh! Ooh! Gross. Okay. What else fun stuff do we have here? What's in here? Chocobo bean popcorn. More darts? Right. My dear beloved girl, I'm so sorry. Dig a hole and throw me in. I'm already dead. My dear beloved girl, I'm so sorry. I don't know what he's going through, but it's rough. This is my jam. It speaks to me. It speaks to me too, lady. Oh, thank you for serenading me. Thank you. Thank you. You're I welcome. I signed records a while back, but I'm still looking for my first big hit. It's been seven years now. Not easy, but you got to do what you love. And I love to sing. This is a new song of mine. Maybe it'll be that number one. I hate to break it to you, buddy, but I don't know if it has number one material. Everybody throwing up around here. Oh, shit! These are high stakes, man. Oh, shit! These are high stakes, man. Why does he sound like Shaggy? Ooh! Kiss Some my intestines ass. right there. Not if you don't make it out of here alive first. Mm. Ready for? It's making me hungry yeah. for dinner. Oh, you bet. Got my orders. I took my wallet. Can't trust anyone these days. It's a hard lesson. All right, well, this was something. How do I get out of here? Ah, yes, the door. <laughs> okay, so now we try down further towards the item shop, I suppose. Ooh, look how pretty it is. Wow. What's in here? Ah. Don't know. Yeah, move. I'm Cloud. Welcome to Walmart's premier weapon shop. Thank you. Oh boy. Oh, we're gonna wanna spend all our money. Oh no. Um. A mighty blade. Ability, Infinity's End, Wind Up and Unleash an Overhead Strike, Increase Damage on Stagger, Cost 2 ATB. I don't want... It's so much gill. But I want it. Okay, here's the trade-off. We'll sell the boots. See? Work. All right, cool. Do come again. Uh, no thank you. Your goods are too pricey. 
around there. Nah, that's a ship. Okay. So we did that. Now what? Can't go in there. Can see what's up here. Check it out. Uh... I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Looking for that Don. Ooh, take. What else do we have around here? Oh, yes, take. What else? What else is around here for the taking? Nothing here. Lame. Anything else? Anything fun? Um, okay. It looks like there was something there. Let's just check it out. Oh, wow. Look at it from the other angle, though. Look how pretty it is. With all the string lights. I love it. Okay, so we went that way, but we didn't go. This sneaky little path. What do we have here? What is, what is this path? What is this path? What the heck? It's a whole thing? All the way to an end? Whoa. I don't know where this leads or if we're supposed to be down here, but we're gonna take it all the way to the end and just see. We're just gonna see. this whatever this is it's locked there's a take in there oh this game is gonna kill me I'm just gonna get a heart attack oh okay is that all this is about Okay. Um, excuse me. Yeah, pardon me. Okay. Well, I'll be honest, this is farther than I got in my Final Fantasy VII original playthrough, so I don't really know what that's referencing. But I, I mean, I know what Avalanche is, but don't really know why I came all the way down here for that written on the wall. Maybe it will become obvious later. I don't know. So I'm gonna guess that I'm not gonna be allowed to just waltz in the front door. Ah, a front door leading to another front door. And that music change. Hello, good sirs. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. You're calling me a pretty We're boy? For someone. Look what you look like. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah. So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute. Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Homely literally you. means it's ugly. Not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. <laughs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M okay. over at the massage parlor. 
Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Oh, Aerith. Okay, this is gonna sound crazy. But... When Cloud says Aerith's name, it just makes me smile. Like, I just like it. I don't know. It's kind of crazy. It's like I recorded so much of this game and I, I know so much of this game, but still hearing another character say her name just makes me giddy for some reason. I don't know. But then also you got the gem there of requesting permission to kill. <laughs> Say that I'll clean up nice, maybe. Rude! Okay, anything else? If you're hell-bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. Okay, anything else? If you're hell-bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. Well then, go bother the trio we shall. Back out these very large doors. Okay, so... Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas... Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But, to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio, right? This wackadoo was running screaming away. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! Oh boy. <laughs> Johnny. Come on Not now. Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. So... He runs past us as we're going to Don Corneo's mansion. Screaming. Then, we go into Don Corneo's mansion, we come out of it, and he's waiting for us. Then, he runs away again. And, and, what then? And what then? Okay. Still can't go in there. I feel so alive. Hey there. Uh, that was creepy. Okay. So, so we need to go. To Chocobo Sam. And lucky us, it's on the way of an area we haven't been before. Perfect. Is this Oh, look at this little this little bar. This little food bar. Hello, sir. Hey there, friend. Grab a seat. Any seat that's open. I recognize this. Right? Isn't this an option in the original game? You still got room for more? But you can't sit. So, what would it be? If you want a recommendation, try the recommended special. Wow! If you want a recommendation, try the recommended special. Huh. Hey there, friend. Grab a seat. Any seat that's open. Well, you can't sit, so it's just kind of a fun little thing to have in there, so... Ooh, dessert! Them two at a time and their flavor will change! I'm telling you folks, you ain't never seen frozen treats like this! Uh -huh. I don't know if I believe you. <laughs> Thank you! That train better get your seat. Okay, now what happens if we go down this direction? Oh, we come back here. Super girls! They're girls that are super! Wait a minute, I haven't been here. Under the Rotting Pizza, the song. Wow, 
Well, that's wild. Okay, is that all there is to this area then? This thing here, it's called a no. That is this area up here. And what is there up here? A take! Oh, and glorious take it is! Right here with this creepy lame man. Alright, so we did that. Great. Now, what about this direction? I'm stuck. Have I triggered something? You do. Yes, you. Do you have a place to stay this enchanted evening? We have the perfect room for a sweet looking couple Why like Why does he look like Tommy Wiseau? What, what is Johnny doing over there? How much? Loud. <laughs> Just give me a holler when you change your mind. I I think I missed something. <laughs> I was a little too concerned with what no Johnny was doing. We can't accommodate. No, sir. So I think he's asking if I want to go in this brothel. And I said how much? Because I was distracted with Johnny. Hey, hey, hey! Yeah. If you're looking for the most unforgettable night of your life, look no further. That's what happens there. Okay, so well, hopefully that doesn't get me in too much trouble. Oh, though. It, this is... Welcome. Are you in need of accommodations? Confused. This looks like just a regular hotel. You know, I've heard from more than a few people that my son John. You're Johnny's father? Before he leaves town, I need to make sure I deliver him his lucky pillow. I have faith in my boy, of course. But a growing man needs plenty of sleep. Sleep of good quality, no less. That's how mind and body stay healthy and active. In other words, this pillow is crucial to his health. <laughs> My wife is back in Sector 7. I thought it best she wait for me there because the establishments in this town are uh, provocative. <laughs> of course, I haven't been to any myself, so I don't know what goes on around here. Not in sure, the Sure, Johnny's father, the saint. Sure. You know, I've heard from more than a few people. Yes, Before he has. leaves town, I need to make but a growing I don't know what this man. lucky <laughs> pillow business is, but I don't like it. It doesn't sound very kosher. Okay. Very tall urinals. Great. A toilet. Great. Uh, a vending machine, but that you can't activate. And a take! And I shall take it. A bottle of adrenaline! Great. Okay. What else do we have here? Oh, shit. Must have fallen asleep or something. I don't know if this is the brothel. I really missed it. Why did Aerith get mad at Cloud saying he'll stay the night? He does look like a hooligan, to be fair. Ah, here's the room with the big beds. Still have to share it, though. What did you expect? You know, something less... Still kind of a gross motel though. Now the question is, do I stay the night? Because is it going to heal and MP restore me? And does it cost money? It's quite crowded at the moment, but I'll see what I can do. I guess see what it does. Have a safe HP trip. and MP fully restored. Great. Uh, okay. 
Now, what was this guy saying? Enjoy a sleepless night in the city true to its name. Wait, was he saying that Aerith was a girl he brought with him? Okay. So... Here's Sam. Alright. And this is back to the wire place. That I cannot for the life of me figure out. Step right up, step right up. It's the fully automated, state of the art item procurement machine. So, what kind of mischief you looking to get up to tonight? You should have known better. Always go Johnny, with your Johnny, what the heck happened to you? Should have said heads. You should have known better. Always go with your gun. Oh, I know what happened. Hey, Chocobo you Sam! Again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, here's out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty, please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa. She's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? So we're gonna play for it. Heads or tails? Now Johnny told us, Call it, Miss always go with your gut. Should've picked heads. So I guess we're going heads. Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. Heads. Wait, she was Tails. supposed to call it. You lose. <sighs> hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Is not quite Corneo's cup of tea. Why is everybody so mean to Aerith's appearance in this well, chapter? If only the Don will do. Try convincing one of the other two. How dare they? That's why it's a trio, and not just the Mio. Now let's get daddled. Play us again, Chocobo Sam. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Yeah. Cheated. Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating. And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. But we got Sam's coin. So we obtained that. Whatever that does for us. Okay. Now on to the one of the next trio. Now, okay, it looks like we can go in any number of orders. So I think we go to Madame M next. There's something downright wrong with this place. That was the best thing that's ever ah, that's why he was like, I feel rejuvenated. I've had new life. Let, let me in. I guess they're closed right now. Ugh. There's this energy pulsing from my fingertips. Ew. Now, what's up this way? We didn't even go this way. Huh. I honestly don't know. I'm pretty sure we came in from this direction, so I honestly don't know what all this area is about. In fact, let's just test it. They might not let us go that way yet. They're letting us go. It's a music change in everything.
Wait, is this the way I came? I'm... Yeah, the caved-in tunnel ex collapsed. Wait, I didn't go this way. Oh, boy. Huh. So both of them are collapsed expressway. So this is the way, oh, I see. So we came in here, I think, and then this way was blocked off. So we had to take this way around. Is that the impression that I'm getting? Let's find out because I can't help myself. Anything exciting going on here? What, what is this little, aha! Tape. A star pendant, perfect for selling. To make some kill. Okay, so then this way we'll loop back around. So let's just, hello, keep going this way just to explore, because we must oh. needs explore. And then while we're walking, we get to enjoy the music. Hmm. This way? There's definitely an unexplored area over here. And yes. some boxes! So we'll smash those. Maybe more. Got it. Awesome. Now, this looks very familiar. It looks to me like <laughs> the way we came. Because of that watery pipe. I've seen this place twice now. And <laughs> why is that area of the? Oh my gosh! Now we gotta do this. I'm coming. need to go through again. So we're gonna go back. Uh, <laughs> oh boy. And I'm so lost. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't know why this area of the map is great in. It's gonna drive me crazy forever, which you all know, but oh well. But in the meantime, we just get to relax and enjoy this experience. This beautiful music. I could have done those voices, but I didn't. It would have been a little hard to take seriously, though. Okay, so we're back in this area. Madam M's seems to be closed right now, but I also can't talk to this guy. And I don't see another way in. So to the honeybee and it is. And we have to go down this way. Through here. Oh, this place is full of 
Uh, maybe up these stairs? Nope, I'm lost. Oh, down these stairs? Yes, okay. Okay, into the honeybee inn. And there's Johnny. What's supposed to go down like this? I think so. wanted to see Andrea. Let me handle this. You wait out here, okay? It was like. Then why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that. You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. <laughs> it's true. Is that Shakespeare? The essence of Andrea Rodea's show is Shakespeare? Pretty sure those lines were from Midsummer Night's Dream. Good evening. Oh. Hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. <laughs> ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh. Oh, we don't have an appointment. No appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required, and the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years? <laughs> All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare. But Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. I guess we'll Otherwise, have to catch his I'm eye sorry, then. But there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Oh, the honey girls and boys. Honey bee girls? Honey bee girls and boys? Okay, look at how... How weightless this bee stinger is like just is it what is it made of is it foam like does it give them lower back pain is it is it plastic i'm com i feel compelled to know the answer to this because it is on such an awkward place on their costume like truthfully if that bee stinger was very heavy, it would weigh down their outfits. And they would like sag over time. I'm just saying, if you're on the level of the Rockettes, you can do better than that. But then again, we don't have to talk about how the rest of their outfit defies physics either. You're not here to gawk at the honey boys? They are honey boys and honey bees. Honey, honey girls. Honey girls and boys. Oh boy. All right. So we got to take a back road in and this looks the most likely. Oh no. Because that's the way in there. So maybe let's go talk to Miss Fiona. Fiona? What's her name? Miss... I practice every second Folia. I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. <sighs> Not helpful. I need the back way in. Really cleaning up tonight, eh? I know why you're here. Oh my god, I finally get to meet Andrea. Just don't forget about me. How oh, am I supposed to get in? I guess we could try this route, although we've already been down this way. Why does this sound like jazzy Christmas music? No, no way! You've lost your marbles, man. 
this way. What's that? You're very interested in the coverage we What's that? I'm a traditional well, thug voice. Like the girl there ever was. It's an undisputed truth. And I okay, so now I sort of feel like maybe... I don't know if we're gonna get in there. So let's try Madame M's one more time. I don't know. Uh oh, I'm gonna get lost here. I am so lost already. stairs up but not those ones oh I'm so lost yep we're yep mm -hmm. let's try this and then this way and then this way and is it one more or straight up okay straight up from here oh Johnny's doing Johnny stuff now <laughs> Okay, so I know we're in the right place. Johnny is just. What's happening? That was the best thing that's ever been done to me. Oh, sweet, sweet, Madam M. And now we can get in. Thanks, Johnny. Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you. Step right up. Now then. What manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm hmm We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension can make a even hand the simplest massage. task of terrible strain. Sure. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, love of... Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. She's oh. so aggressive! Ugh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. A respectable but if you don't establishment. Our then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well She got great makeup though. Hmm. Name. Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? <laughs> Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud, let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? My, my! I guess we didn't need this much gill, but I'm glad we have it. I feel like we have to go luxury because we have it. We've got the gill, so let's just spend it on the luxury hand massage. Cannot possibly think of a reason why not. <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back and wait. Cloud? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well-to-do patrons. <laughs> First, He's laying the hand on hand. a bed a for a hand massage. And every one of your richly deserving fingers. Oh my. Let's start with the tips. That's it. Relax. He is so I'm not relaxed. Just like I am not relaxed right now. Oh, oh. 
Oh, cloud. Oh. Did that hurt? No. <laughs> then I'll move on to the base of the finger. <laughs> Let's see if we can't improve your circulation and get that blood flow. This is so suggestive. <laughs> no, don't fight it. Stress is poison to the body. <laughs> And finally, some gentle stimulation for the palm. No more than a touch. Just like this. <laughs> oh, what was that? A cry of pleasure? <laughs> is this how you like it? <laughs> how about this? Wait, <laughs> it's getting more suggestive. I can't. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I was not expecting that. Oh, if I'm that blushing. Was liking, do come <laughs> right. Oh my goodness. That was that was something. How was it? Huh? <laughs> He's not even gonna talk to her. <gasps> I'm playing his ear in. Yeah. You're acting weird, Cloud. I am? Really weird. <laughs> He's so zoned out. Think you'll make a habit of it? That's a full-on, I'll have what he's having moment. All right, then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So? Tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. I need an audition. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm. Okay. Really? But you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? No. So I'm gonna go with. Looks comfortable means subtly it's ugly, but hey, it's comfy. It's all right is probably the most neutral of all of them. So I'll go with that. It's all right, I guess. <laughs> oh, you. Look. Just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. Oh no, I spent so all much. my money on the massage! What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes. For the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. All you right! They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. We should hurry. Run along. Okay, and we hit a checkpoint. Nice. What? Keep your filthy hands to yourself. Um, you were all over these filthy hands not five minutes ago, madam. Remember? You are going to win me that money. Anywho, Madam Hypocrite, if I do say so myself. Um, okay, so that's this area. So Madam M is voiced by Mallory, who some of you know if you've been following me for a year or more. Um, I worked on Wasted, the, the pilot, with Josh. One of Josh's previous 
projects, Mallory was in. And I didn't know until the cast list got released and I got to see and I was like, wait a minute, what a small world. And so we connected on Twitter and that was fun. Very small world, this world we live in. Okay. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think we can win it all? That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. I appreciate the confidence, just don't get too cocky, okay? How about you, Cloud? Do you feel rejuvenated and alive? Do you have energy flowing from your fingertips? Let's see, where is the, oh ho, okay, so this is the Colosseum. That's why that was blocked off. Okay. Okay, okay. We're moving along. We're getting there. And everything, I just have to look at the map every five seconds. <laughs> this way, this way. Pretty sure. This way, yes. And then it's right here. Oh, and now it's open. Great. Is Johnny around here? Is he going to tell us? Something crazy. Mm -hmm. What is going on here? I do not like that. That is creepy. Good thing we splurged. Right? And it was worth every last one. <laughs> this check in is for spectators only. Well, then. And right there. My dear friends, is where we're going to end today's episode. Please leave me a comment and let me know what your favorite part was. I mean, isn't it obvious what your favorite part should be? Isn't it? I know what mine is. So that's going to be all for today's video. I don't know. Sometimes I just get so goofy. Okay, remember to like the video if you enjoyed it. Share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course, remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell for Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. Sound like a plan? That's all. I love you all. Bye!